Straight from Escondido Charter is the prize is right. With our first prize, what do we have on offer tonight, Rod? It's a brand new song to my floor! Oh, yeah. With the bonus real life application problems and distracting color illustrations. Alright, that is a wonderful prize. Let's see what you think it is worth. Try to get as close as you can to the actual retail price without going over. Let's see, what do you think, Joe? Uh, Two dollars. Two dollars. Yeah. Alright, two dollars. <laughs> 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd, Cooney. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's pretty good. Next step, Ada, Adam, what do you think? Four. Four. And one cent. Oh. All right, 201. Finally, Dahlia, what is your best guess? Cooney, I'm going to have to go with absolute value of 3 minus x times square root of 89 all over factorial 0.21. That's what you said. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Looks like Dolly will continue on to the next step of our show. Oh, we have someone from Prentice Hall Marketing Department. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We might be able to accommodate uh, Lydia as well. What can we do about that? Well, I'd like to invite both the Saxon and Hall families down to the stage for Family Feud. <laughs> <laughs> Let's play. The top four answers are on the board. Name one item that every student should bring to math class. Lydia. A ruler. All right. Okay, show me a ruler. Yes. yes. All right. Do you want to pass or play? Play. play, play, play. We're gonna play. Who needs to play? All right. They're gonna play. Okay, big spender. What do you think? What name one item that every student should bring to math class? Their piggy bank. Good answer. Show me piggy bank. Oh, I'm sorry. Except Joel, what do you think, Joel? Uh, a writing utensil. <laughs> Alright, show me writing utensil. Alright. Next up, Jonathan. Name one item every student should bring to math class. <laughs> uh, their sweatshirt! Alright. Good answer. Show me sweatshirt. <laughs> I'm sorry. Nana Izzy, name one item. Please hurry. Please hurry. Please hurry. Please hurry. I'll brush me, whippersnapper. Paper. Alright, show me paper. Yes! And that is correct. With two strikes. This is your last chance to do this one for the fam, Jerry. Name one item. 
Uh, well, Ron, I'm going to have to go with a calculator. Awesome. My name is Kuni, but uh, go ahead. Show me calculator. Call your ball, Jerry. Cut the donkey. What? <laughs> Let's see if our Saxon family can steal. What do you think, Dahlia? We're gonna have to go with math book. Yeah! Alright, for the steal, show me math book. Alright! Let's go! Alright, let's see if we moving on to the next phase. Whoa! I'm sorry, hold on a second, Rod. There might be a glimmer of hope. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, uh, let's see if we can get a parting, uh, uh, some kind of prize for our Prentice Hall family. Can we do that, Ron? Well, we can take our Prentice Hall family over to the Wheel of Calculator! <laughs> Today, one of these lucky contestants will win his or her weighted calculators here on Wheel of Calculators! <laughs> okay, Who's a, who wants to get the Wheel Big Spin? <laughs> Give it a big spin! <laughs> Alright. Ooh, mmm, TI-83 plus. Casio FX 260 Solar. Mmm, very economical. Alright, now. Do you want to hold on to your Casio FX 260 Solar, or do you want to go for the box that? Hanasan is bringing down the aisle right now! What's it gonna be? I'll take the box. You took the box! Let's see what's in the box! Who? <laughs> nothing! Absolutely nothing! Stupid! You're so stupid! Saxon family, we have prepared two wonderful showcases. Would you like to select showcase number one or showcase number two? What does the audience think? Two. Two. Showcase number one. All right, we have selected showcase number one. What wonderful surprises do they have in store, Rod? Well, Cooney, in showcase number one, we have an assortment of colored calculator cases. Your T84 will be stylish and protected with these shock-resistant polyurethane faceplates, but they won't look quite as good as your brand new bronze Abraham Lincoln box. Yeah. This tin of copper alloy is weather-resistant and the perfect patriotic mantelpiece. Abe will be able to remind you that honesty is the best policy. But not only that, but you'll be cruising with your year-long membership to Proden's Mini Disc Golf Camp. <laughs> Two mini disc golf poles and fine dining. A breathtaking view will make this membership unforgettable, but not as unforgettable as your brand new untamed white tiger. <laughs> then, caught fresh from India, this sparkly feline will be the ultimate guard cat. Impress your guests and keep away burglars with this frisky feline. <laughs> wow, that is those are some amazing prizes. I'm sure you're really going to enjoy those. Let's see what they passed up, Rod. What was in showcase number two? Well, Cooney, in showcase number two, we have a year's supply of graph paper. This high-quality crisscross goodness would have made your graphs picture perfect, but not as perfect as the all-expense-paid trip to the grocer. <laughs> Price means more saving. It may be past the Best Buy date, but remember, a Best Buy date is not an expiration date. It's not a safe date, and it's cheaper than you expected. Regardless, it's not as safe as what could have been your brand new Easy Go Golf Car. With an impressive 0.5 horsepower, this all electric wheel. Four-wheel gas saver would have saved the planet and made your buddies and their Bentleys jealous. Top of the line safety and design would have saved your lives and social images. What a shame. Uh, but it's okay. Everyone is here a winner every day on Cooney's Crazy Competition. Good night, everybody. Have a great day.